The state Senate passed its $1.3 billion incentive package for Scout Motors today. That's the company that's going to set up shop in Blythewood. News 19 Zoe Henry has the details. JR Scout Motors says with the 4,000 jobs it's bringing to South Carolina, when the company is fully up and running and under the deal approved today, 80% of those workers will be South Carolina residents. Take a listen. I've come to the conclusion that because of the potential scope of this project, that I'm okay with $1.3 billion. As long as South Carolinians are going to get the benefit of the jobs. In discussions about the electric car manufacturer Scout Motors incentive package, Senator Shane Massey requested the company hire locally. He says this could help with South Carolina population retention. I think we have the people in South Carolina to do those do those jobs. Um, I, th I think we, we definitely have the people here. I am concerned about their ability right now to compete for those jobs. While it may keep South Carolinians here, there were concerns about using taxpayer dollars for the $1.3 billion package. The way that we compete, would you agree, the way that we compete in the marketplace of states is having a favorable tax environment. In other words, reducing taxes or having a favorable cost of living. Despite that concern, the package passed on Tuesday afternoon. Uh, so it's a done deal now and it'll go to the governor's desk and he'll sign it and we'll be seeing Scout come to South Carolina, which is exciting. Bringing 4,000 jobs and over $2 billion in investment in this state. The incentive package passed 29 votes in favor and 10 opposed. Scout's plant will be built near Blythewood, and work on it is expected to start as early as this summer. They hope to be making cars three years from now. In the studio, Zoe Henry, News 19, WLTX.